Ever since it happened, it's been quiet. The streets are empty. There's silence is quite unnerving. It's stressful. When I was back at school, I wasn't some athletic kid. I wasn't the smartest. I was just a normal kid. Just Jared. Speaking of the school, it's already looted and in shambles. The looters already came through. That was about a month ago, and now it's just been me. But me being a teenage boy, it's hard for me to live without power. I need to watch TV, surf the internet for hours on end, or listen to music. I can't do any of that. It makes me wonder. If someone had internet access, would anything still be online, or would it be blank? Would anything still be automated on TV? Half our lives were ruled by automated technology, and now is our downfall. That's what caused all of this. I always try to think of the necessities, but it's hard when you cannot forget your loved ones. I still keep this picture. They remind me of the good times in my life. I miss them so much. They were the light in my day. I'll never forget my parents, but this picture is all I have to remember them. Life is real hard now. Food is scarce. It's hard to find anything not spoiled by now. I tried the grocery store, but it was already cleared out. I already went through the gas station, ate all the food before it spoiled. Sometimes I'll be able to get a bird here and there, but my BB gun won't do me much good for anything big. My dad had a gun or two in his bedroom, but those are still locked in a safe, so that's the best I have. It won't scare anyone away either, especially if the mechs make a sweep again, looking for more humans to power their ships. That's how it ended up like this. I thankfully was hidden well, and I didn't go and see what was happening. I knew it was bad, so I sat where I was and didn't move until it was silent. And the silence soon became painful to my ears. The ears that had only experienced a loud world. Attention to what? Why'd you empty my pockets? You know, kid, if you don't tell us all we need to know, I'm going to have to kill you. The tips you share with them hurts our group. Helps who? I don't know what you're talking about. It's obvious that you're with the machines. No kid like you can last as long as you have without being with them. Not to mention that your parents are engineers for neurotech. I have not seen the machines. I was hidden when they came through, and my parents worked on different products at Neurotech. Yeah, the mechs have been here three times already. Our buildings are getting weaker, our numbers are getting smaller, we're losing the people we love. Don't give me that. We've all lost something in our lives that we love. I hate to tell you this, but if you don't talk and tell me what you've done, I'm going to have to kill you. What's the difference? Even if I had the information you wanted, you'd still kill me. Yes, but... Hey! Hey, he's gonna get away! And I'm on the road again. I don't know where I'll go. I can't go back to my house. The men know where that is. I don't even know where I am now, but it's back to what I know. Worries, lonesome, and the silence. <laughs> 